Next, esophagus. Esophagus is a narrow tube from the mouth to the stomach. In other words, esophagus is a connecting tube. It connects the mouth to the stomach. So when you swallow or you feed your mouth with any food, it will pass through the esophagus to reach the stomach. Okay? The esophagus don't really secrete any enzyme, so there is no new digestion. However, there is existing digestion. Remember the existing digestion that you have done earlier? Starch breakdown into maltose. This is still happening in the esophagus. Huh? Slurry amylase will still be there. Okay? Until it reached the stomach. The esophagus contains two muscular layers over here. Two muscular layers. The outer layer is called the longitudinal muscle. The inner layer is called the circular muscle. Okay, this muscle re repeatedly contract and relax to push the stomach, sorry, to push the food into the stomach. This so-called contraction and relaxation is known as peristalsis. It happens all along the alimentary canal. It happens in the small intestine, it happens in the large intestine. Okay, you never wonder why or how food move along the small intestine. It's why a peristalsis is why the contraction and relaxation of muscles in the small intestine and also the large intestine. Okay.